Hey YouTubers, it's Mark from True Seeker. I'm in Soul 637. And uh, let's take a look at some of this manipulation we got today. Now, from here, they want you to think this is a rock. But this is what it is. First of all, just number one, blurring and cover up. This looks to be some type of tank. It comes all the way down. And it's got some type of connector coming out into this unit here that they blocked and pixelated. Now you can see how certain areas are blurred. Now in no way, shape, or form does this just look like gravel and rocks. This is I mean, like, well, we knew what we were going to get on the way to Mount Sharp. We knew it was going to get rough. There was going to be way too, too many anomalies for them to cover up. And this is what we're getting. You see this stuff? It's on some type of rectangular base. See how they mix the pixels up? Like this pixel maybe belongs like a puzzle. This pixel belongs here. They're just moving, they're pixelating it, and then they're moving the pixels around. And from a distance, it somewhat resembles a picture. From a distance. Now look at this thing. This piece is coming up, there's a shadow. Here is some type of statue. There would be the head the body coming down. This pixel belongs here. You would move this pixel to here. It's like a puzzle. This is what they're covering up, folks. This is your taxpayer money. Look at this. Oh, man, this stuff is... This stuff's probably amazing. But the great thing is, between some of the pixels, you can actually see what's going on. Look at this piece of machinery that they just... See, it's funny because see how they pixelate everything and then this thing is just left as clear as day and then they start with the pixelation again I think because it's totally black the computer leaves it for some reason now I had to adjust the color and adjustments on this picture to even see any you know any of the detail but I think that's why, when this stuff is just black, black, they just leave it. Because unless you really mess with the adjustments, you can't get any detail out of it, so. But, uh, I mean, look at this area. It looks like all types of piping and carvings and statues. And look at the base on this. See how it's a rectangle? Then it's got this little triangle opening with something sticking out. There's a bar. There's another hole with something sticking out. You can see that this is a carved base. Maybe a statue was on it at one time. Or who even knows, maybe there's a statue that's being built that's going on it. <laughs> so. But to me, this is an amazing photo. And for people with a little common sense and know what they're looking at, this is going to blow them away, too. See how they just added this black here? This black is just hanging in the air. It makes no sense. So when you zoom out, people look at it. Oh, it's just, you know, it's just a shadow. Yeah, but look what it's covering up. See how they put this black here? See what it's covering up.
NASA, the people are awake. The people are looking. So look out. Look at this stuff. There's shadows underneath these structures. Look at this head. Look at this. This is some type of base. It's a platform. Or a doubt platform with the stuff is on. Shadows. This thing is cool though. It's some type of tank. A little pipe coming out. It's, it's just, well, from back here, they want you to think it's a rock. Now, this is in Photoshop. Same picture. I just toned down what they, uh, the, you know, tried to make it somewhat resemble a picture. You can still see the tank with the piece coming out. You see these carvings? How that looks like maybe a little, uh, just a little area. Maybe these are little bushes. See the symmetry of this area? It's got a little piece sticking up. See this? Just got all this stuff laid out. What the hell kind of rocks are those? <laughs> My rocks don't look like that. See how this stuff is hidden? See how half of that's cut off? Half of that pixel's gone. See this carving? This is a statue that stands up. Back here's another one. Well, what happens is they add this fake ground, and sometimes, most of the time, the shadows disappear. So what happens is you look at an item, and you think it's part of the ground. See, like this item here? Now, we know this is not part of the ground because we see a little piece of shadow, so it gives us that 3D perspective. When the shadows disappear, you know, it's hard to tell what's standing, what's not. So look at this. Yeah, that's what, <clears throat> excuse me, that's what gives our brain and our eyes perspective, is shadows. See how huge this is? This, this thing comes across, see the shadow underneath it? This is a huge pipe that comes across to some type of fitting. There's some type of circular ball here, whether it's a tank. This has got two supports. But you see it's a large pipe and you see the shadow underneath. See? The computer didn't get, the computer didn't adjust the shadow on that one. Okay. But they figure from nobody's looking at this stuff from here, you know. And you see this, how they covered this statue up? And you see this little piece here? A little shadow. This is a gigantic carving. Look at 
looks like another, maybe it's a two or something. But see, as far as size, I believe you would walk under here and this thing would be huge. It'd be like as high as a two story house. And the pictures that they put the rover in, like you would see the rover, like you would see the rover on the edge of the photo right here. I believe those are just added. That's just computer cut and paste. When I uh, pull it apart and really look at the edges, I could tell that it's just uh, there's artifact, digital artifacts there that they're just cut and pasted. Look at this statue. See the shadow underneath it. That's a statue. What they're doing is they're taking these pictures from so far away. And then what they're doing is they're cropping them. Now, see, I used the burn tool on this little area here and a little sharpening. And look, look what comes out. You see the monuments and... See the shadow underneath that little. Uh, here goes another one. See how this comes up? See the shadow? These are all 3D statues. Stand up, touch them, feel them. A lot of them are a lot taller than we are. To this area here. I'm going to use the burn tool and a little sharpening here. Now, if I use video capture software, I can't get you any of this detail. Nothing. Nothing. Nothing close to this. This is why I use a handheld. And as I said before, I tried so many different types of cameras, and the only thing that came close to making me happy is uh, a Nikon. It's like one of those 300, six, I think it was like six something, you know, it's a six, seven hundred dollar Nikon camera. I picked it up on eBay cheap, like three, almost four hundred dollars used. But, uh, look at this stuff. That's just one one part of the hurdle, you know. I put the picture in Photoshop, you know, I could see all this stuff. But to get it to translate to video to show you guys is not easy, you know. And most people understand that. You know. That's why I tell everybody, use this as a map. Go download the picture yourself. Manipulate it a little in Photoshop. And, you know, see what you find too, you know. I'll try to do my best to show you the anomalies. You see the structure in this piece? It's got a little pattern in the center. See this the silhouette, how this is cut out? a white statue behind it. Another statue right behind it. And you see this this stuff is just amazing. Amazing. And this there's the eye, the mouth area. Amazing, amazing, amazing stuff.
look at this. Man, I would love, love to see this, this picture unedited. You could just see what's between some of the pixels. It's amazing. This area is just full with statues. You would trip over them probably. But the way they manipulated this picture. You know, it's, it's easy for them to hide. They, they just put that black smudge there and it covers up this huge statue. You could see the outline of it. And all this fake blur comes down here. You see how that line? It almost looks like there's somebody sitting up there. Head, the, you can see their arms. Looks like somebody's sitting right on that statue. You see it? And they just put all this fake blur. That's a rock, okay. You see the smudge they put back here? Looks like a metallic tank. Like a storage tank. They put that smudge right across. There's a building. There's that statue I was showing you before. See the black smudge they put there? It's becoming pretty hard for them to hide this stuff. I mean, they're doing their best. I give them credit. They're doing a pretty, pretty banged up job at it. When they get done, it doesn't even resemble a photo. That's what brings all the suspicion to these pictures. Because <laughs> they don't even look like pictures anymore. And you can just see these are buildings, these are structures, there's piping. Look at the size of this stuff. You can see this is an area, there's buildings, you would walk through here, you could see the different levels. You see all the different levels. See all these structures. They're covering up this building here. Well, most of this back here is fake. You really can't even do any work on these mountains. See this, these, these poles coming up? They got shadows. This is like some type of dome with windows or something. Some type of openings. It's hard to really do any... Well, this looks like a square entrance. It looks like there's some type of ball tanks on the side here. Look at this. They, they erased all of this. Looks like buildings. See all that black smudging? That's covering up. Okay. They put black smudging in here. It's just covering up these buildings. Now these look like circular buildings. So you can't really do any work on these mountain ranges because they're all fake. It's all CGI. It's just all fake. When I go back, I look at different pictures of these, the back, and the mountains don't even match up. Sometimes they don't even resemble. <laughs> you know, from one picture, you know, from one salt to the next. You know. But, uh, you know, to about here, I believe it's somewhat real. Beyond there, I believe most of it's fake. But you could see what they're covering up. See how they put this heavy blocking. You could see there looks like roads and stuff back there. See how the road cuts over here? It looks like that. Comes through here. You could, you could just see that there's pathways, roads. You could see the structures of the buildings.
hurry, guy. You, you know what to do. I think this is a good one. I hope you enjoy it. Like it, share it. You know what to do. Two seekers out.